Right now, the Metro rallies behind the Millard North baseball community. A player on the JV team is in the hospital. He suffered serious injuries during last, his last game of the season. But as KETV News Watch 7's Cal Larson shows us, rival teams are cheering on his recovery. Pete Steffenmeyer was injured Friday night when he dove for a ball in the outfield. As you'll hear, the entire baseball community is behind him. District semifinals, among the most competitive games all season. But before first pitch Monday between Miller North and Creighton Prep. We'd like for you to know that the entire Creighton Prep community would like to extend our thoughts and prayers to the Stephens Meyer family. A show of solidarity. We ask that everyone continue to pray for Pete as he battles back. Pete Stephens Meyer is on Miller North's JV baseball team. During the game at Creighton Prep last Friday, Pete collided with a teammate. He suffered a skull fracture and multiple facial fractures. You put a game on the back burner when something tragic like this happens. Miller North Athletic Director Keith Malley says it's been incredible seeing the community rally around Pete. The community support that we've had over the last 48 hours has just been tremendous and we thank everybody for that. Malley credited and thanked the Creighton Prep community for their quick action following the injury. Their response to Pete and his family was outstanding. Um, they had a medical doctor, from what I understand, here that night that was out on the field instantaneously. That support extends to Westside High School, where the team's initial fundraiser at Down and Millie's has now transformed to raise funds to support the Steffens Myers medical bills. 20% of Monday's proceeds will go toward the Steffens Myers. In a statement Monday, the Millard School District said, Our Miller North community remains very concerned for one of our own. This was a terrible accident, and our hearts go out to Pete and his family. Malley sums it up. We're just hoping and praying that good things come his way and, and he's making some positive strides. The fundraiser is at Don and Millie's on 108th and West Center. That goes until 9 p.m. You can tell the cashier you're there to support the Stephens Meyer family. In Omaha, Cat Larson, KTV News Watch 7.